if you think about 10 years ago, the state of the art in neuroscience would be to train an animal on a very interesting behavioral task and then record activity from a single neuron at a time while animal is performing the task. So now if you think about decisions, it takes maybe a couple hundred milliseconds for an animal to make a choice. It's a very short time. And neurons fire discrete pulses, spikes, and the firing rates are not very high. Maybe it is about 10 hertz or 20 hertz. So while animal is making a decision, you will be able to record only 10 very brief signals. And the pattern of the spikes will be very different on each instance of animal making a decision. It therefore becomes very hard to deduce anything about the algorithm which animal is using based on this very sparse data. What we can do now with our methods is actually to record from several areas simultaneously at the same time. And with very precise mathematical tools, we can deduce fine differences in the calculation which each individual area is performing. So this helps us to identify the role of each individual areas and how they talk to each other.